Brendan in Ontario, Canada. And I, I know people say, well, you, you, you don't have to say Canada. Well, actually, there is an Ontario, California, so I'm going to say Canada. <laughs> but I'm sure they're both lovely places. All right. Uh, hey, Paul, I'm building a new listening room. Good job. And I have both phases of the 240 volts power available for 120 volt operation. Are there any issue using both phases? All right, so let's explain first what he's, he's talking about. In the United States, our power comes in basically at 230, 240 volts. And it does so with two phases of 120 volts each. And when you combine these two phases together, you get 240 volts. Now, in this country, we use that 230, 240 volts to run our our uh, ovens, our um, uh, dry electric dryers, anything that my car, my, my Tesla, uh, the charger for the Tesla runs on 230 volts. And that is a combination of two 120 volt circuits that are separate and those are flipped in phase. So between them you got 240 volts, 30, whatever you got coming into your house, and each one's only worth 115 or 120, okay? Now, normally when your house is wired and you have all these outlets, they'll use one phase for, say, half the house and another phase for the other half of the house. All of it's 120 volts. All of it works together. And yes, you can do that. I don't think I would do that. And I certainly wouldn't do it without hiring an electrician because you don't want to mess that up. You really don't want to mess that up. So I would get yourself an electrician that knows what he's doing. Hey, I know electrical engineering. I know how to design with transistors. Our chief engineer, Bob Stadther, is also uh, an electrical wizard, and he does a lot of wiring around here. So he'd probably be a better person to answer. I know that you can do what you're speaking of. And in some homes, uh, one half the room has one phase, and the other half the room has another phase. So I don't think there's a danger to it, but I wouldn't do it personally because I guess I'm just enough of a symmetry freak to want it all to be on the same phase. But I've heard stories from people that run one channel out of one phase and the other channel out of the other phase. Ground in all these things is common. It's an earth ground, so you don't have to worry about that, but eh, I don't think I would do it. You can, but, and if you do, check with an electrician first. All right, thanks for the question. Bye.